December 20th, 2017, the day that changed my life. Now before I actually get into this video guys, I just want to say really quick, um, there's some really important things that I want to talk about in this video, so I would appreciate it if you guys would stay for the whole video and watch the whole thing. So a little bit of backstory, I guess, with me and kind of YouTube. Um, I want to say back when I was about 9 years old, somewhere, maybe 10, somewhere around there, I found out about Minecraft from um, one of my good friends and um, yeah he got me into Minecraft and then once I started playing it more I would always like like I started watching videos about it on YouTube and I used to watch like all kinds of mods and stuff and I thought it would be so cool because at the time I only had a phone to play it on and so I would I'd play it on my my phone and I always wanted to get it on a computer and then when I finally got a laptop uh, for my 11th birthday I was I was so happy um, and I went straight to, you know, playing Minecraft and soon enough I started trying to make videos on it. And, you know, I've had, a, I've had a lot of different channels with a lot of different names, which I'm sure is true for almost any YouTuber. You know, most people don't get it right the first time, but yeah, it took me about three and a half years to, um, finally get this channel to, to the point where, you know, I'm actually getting a decent amount of views and have a decent amount of subscribers. But anyway, before this channel had any success, um, probably like, you know, towards the end of middle school and um, as a freshman in high school, you know, I wasn't too happy with my life. Um, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm In real life, I'm socially awkward. Even though I might not seem like it online, I am in real life. But anyways, I didn't have a whole lot of friends in school. And so the summer after eighth grade, you know, I kept telling myself, I'm going to change it when I get to high school. I'm going to I'm going to talk to people. I'm going to make friends. But, you know, when high school actually came around, I got too scared to actually do it. I never really made any change. And I was basically at the same place um, that I was like a year before. So once my channel actually, you know, started growing, that was one of the things that made me start to feel better about myself and make me happy. So I'm going to give you guys a little bit of um, a backstory on what was going on this day. So it's winter break. Uh, last year we got out for winter break, at least my school did, on December 18th. So it's two days after winter break started. I'm on Hypixel playing with a friend of mine that I had met online. MVP++ had just came out. And so I saw a bunch of people were making stream parties with MVP++, getting people to join their parties and watch their streams. And so even though I didn't have MVP++ yet, I just had MVP+. I thought, hey, why not why not try to make a party, see people join, and stream it, see if they'll join the stream. So I made a party, and I would go to every lobby, and I said, type, I think I said like type 1, or 1, 2, 3, something like that, if you want to join my party, I'm streaming. So I got a few people to join the party, and um, once I got them in the party, I would give them my stream link. And so for back then, with like how my previous videos had done back then, I uh, I was really happy with the results. I got like something like 50 or 55 views, which was I was really happy about back then. I just started the stream. We should be live now. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can get some people to join. I'm gonna uh, advertise in the games too. You're gonna get banned. That's ah. dumb. But you know whatever. Yellow. For them views. For real, dude. Oh. <laughs> so I decided that I wanted to get MVP++ to make it easier. But what I did was I asked for MVP++ for Christmas. Christmas came and I actually did get 6 months of MVP++. So I didn't actually stream again though until January 3rd, which by the way is the day after I got my dog. But anyway, I didn't stream again until January 3rd. But when I did, it did really good too like I think it got about 80 85 views which that's actually pretty decent even now for me but uh, back then that was really good and so once I saw how good it was actually doing I started streaming like daily like I think I I remember waking up and streaming every day at about 11 a.m. and doing this for all of winter break for the whole winter break I did this and by the time winter break was over, I believe I had about 250 subs, which is crazy. Like that amount of growth in like, what is it, like three weeks? That's, that's insane. And so, you know, I was really happy about it. And then, of course, once school started back up, it, it slowed down a little bit because, you know, I had stuff to do with school. I was doing track. Um, 
So, you know, I wasn't able to stream as much, but it was still constant. I think I streamed still about every other day. And, you know, the channel just kept growing really fast. Like, I hit 100 something, 200, and 300. Just, it was all so fast. And I couldn't believe it. And honestly, it made me feel a lot better about myself. It made me feel like my life was sort of coming together. Which might sort of seem dumb, but, you know, that's how I felt at the time. I was really happy about it. That's kind of, you know, uh, my origin story with YouTube, I guess. And, you know, even though now uh, my channel growth has slowed down a lot, I'm not going to deny that. And I think a large part of it is because I don't have very much time to do YouTube anymore, at least on the weekdays. Because, you know, with school, um, I just have so much more homework than I did last year that I just don't have a lot of time to be streaming after school. And, you know, sometimes I'll do it when I have extra time, but a lot of the times I don't have that time which is unfortunate, so I've only really been able to stream on the weekends. And you know, even though my channel has slowed down, you guys can trust me when I say I'm not giving up. I plan to keep going on YouTube for a long time, but yeah, that's about it. I just want to say thank you again. You guys really have changed my life, whether you believe it or not, you have. I am so much happier today than I was one year ago, and it's just, I don't have the words, just thank you. And I'll see you guys in 2019.